Successors to a famous World War II squadron are in Santa Barbara tonight. They're guests of the Pierre Clayson's Veterans Foundation. News Channel 3's Tracy Lair spoke with members of the Black Sheep Squadron today, and she joins us live from Santa Barbara Airport. Tracy, some people expected to see the old Corsairs, but they actually saw Harrier jets instead. They did. They flew the Corsairs during World War II. Nowadays, they fly the Harriers, which are capable of vertical takeoffs and landings. And the squadron got its black sheep name from pilots considered misfits. It's not every day Harrier attack jets fly into the Santa Barbara airport. This noisy arrival is historic. The freedoms that we have now to go out and, and, uh, and run around and play and not have to worry about, about terrorists and, and all that is, is due to the folks that were in the squadron back in the day. Marine Attack Squadron 214 is the successor to the Black Sheep Squadron of World War II fame. The 1970s Baa Ba Black Sheep TV show starring Robert Conrad was based on the memoir of its commanding officer, Gregory Pappy Boynton. Mark Elfer serves as commander now. We enjoy flying. It's a pilot's airplane, uh, but it's not unsafe. It's extraordinarily combat worthy. The squadron trained at Marine Corps Air Station Santa Barbara in 1944 after Boynton was captured by the Japanese. Veterans mourning one of the original men invited the pilots and their crew to spend VE day here. It's kind of neat. It's kind of neat. You know, it brings back a lot of memories from, uh, I hate to tell you how many years ago. 60? Yeah, a lot of years ago. Get your earplugs ready for their departure. And the pilots really do recommend earplugs like these because the Harriers are very loud. And you can see them take off for home to their home base in Yuma, Arizona, sometime tomorrow afternoon. Tonight, they are enjoying the Santa Barbara nightlife. At the Santa Barbara Airport, Tracy Lair, News Channel 3.